Good morning, my friends. It's me again, your favorite denture wearer. It's early. Sure hope everybody's doing okay today. I have another great example of never give up. Now, you remember I talked about buying an old truck. Uh, when I first went up there to get the truck or to look at the truck or to buy the truck, uh, I made one trip up there. It's about 45 miles. I made a trip up there to buy the truck if I could get it running or if it would crank over because I knew if it cranked over I could get it running. So I went up there and it cranked over. So I bought the truck and I messed with it for about four hours and got it running. The next time I went up there, the following weekend, my brother took me up there and the plan was to get it running good enough to drive it home. And that didn't happen because the carburetor is was junk just junk so we got a new carburetor for it and then we went up there on sunday put the carburetor on it and drove it home <laughs> there she is my friends sitting in the yard now it is really hard to coordinate videos between this channel and my Bill's Life Like It or Don't channel. So check this out. She's in rough shape. Needs a headliner. Gauges don't work. Well, the fuel gauge does, but no other gauges. Gonna need to put a new blinker switch in it. New horn, but oh. Wow, the horn works crazy anyway got to put a new blinker switch in it that one's seized up got to do a bunch of wiring and stuff anyway that's not the point of this video <laughs> i love these old trucks <laughs> the point of this video is even though it took me three times going up there to get this truck I got it. I was not going to take no for an answer from this truck. She looks bigger in the video than she actually is. She's actually not that big. She's not much bigger than a pickup. A little bit taller. A little bit taller. Let me do it this way. So you can see it's really not that big of a truck. A little bit taller than a pickup. But as you can see, it's not much taller than me. So, anyway, a prime example of never give up because, like I said, it took three trips up there. The third trip, I knew we were going to get it. Second trip, I wasn't sure. I knew I had it running on the first trip. I knew I had it running. But what happened on the second trip was we realized that the carburetor was just shot. There was absolutely no way that it was going to drive home. So, third trip, we knew we'd get it. So, huge shout out to my brother for taking the time to help me out with that. Take me up there and follow me home and everything. Now, <clears throat> I, I like to present things like this because... Um, oh yeah, here's a little clip of me driving at home, just so you can see that. You, you'll see that video if you go to my Bill's Life Like It or Don't channel linked in the description. You can see the entire video of me driving at home. It's not the entire hour of me driving it, but there's several clips in there of me driving at home. So I was extremely ecstatic. I was so happy. To finally be able to go get my truck that I just bought and it's gonna need a, it needs a lot of work but I have all winter to work on it I got all the time in the world to work on this truck this is not gonna be a daily driver it's not something that I'm gonna restore to a you know beautiful mint condition or anything like that it's a project and it's gonna be a blast it's gonna give me something to do 
It's going to be fun. I'm going to enjoy it. And I'm not going to give up on it. <laughs> and, you know, I like to present things like this because, no, it may not have anything to do with dentures, but it still coincides with everything I've been saying about your dentures. Keep smiling, keep trying, and never give up.